The Panhard VBR, Vehicule Blinder Rues, multi-purpose armored vehicles was developed as a private venture following the success of the Panhard VBL armored scout car. The VBR has similar layout to the VBL, but with increased dimensions and payload. Vehicle can undertake a wide range of battlefield missions. The first prototype was revealed in 2002. However eventually the Panhard VBR received no production orders from the French army or export customers. The Panhard VBR is larger than the well-known VBR armored car. Also it has more internal space. The VBR has a crew of two and provides accommodation for two to seven troops, depending on the mission variant. A baseline vehicle has four doors and rear doors. The VBR has a payload capacity of 2 to 2.5 T, depending on the version. Armor of the VBR provides protection from small arms fire and artillery shell splinters. Add-on composite armor provides protection against 14.5 mm armor-piercing rounds. So once add-on armor is fitted the Panhard VBR is resistant to heavy machine gun fire. Vehicle has a V-shaped floor to provide increased protection against mines. It is also fitted with anti-mine layer, as well as NBC protection and fire suppression systems. The first prototype of the VBR was fitted with a remotely controlled weapon station, armed with a 12.7mm machine gun. The Panhard VBR can be fitted with various other weapons, such as 40mm automatic grenade launcher, cannon, or anti-tank missiles. To reduce price and life cycle costs, the Panhard VBR uses many commercially available components, including diesel engine and transmission. Vehicle is powered by the MTU-4R106 diesel engine, developing 325 horsepower. The Panhard VBR is fitted with run-flat tires and central tire inflation system. Vehicle is not amphibious, however its amphibious propulsion system was under development. This armored vehicle is well suited for airlifts. It can be airlifted by medium transport aircraft, such as the C-130 Hercules so it can be rapidly deployed anywhere in the world.